Lesson 7.2c, using proportional relationships to find distance on a map. We're going to learn about scale and scale drawings. A scale drawing is a drawing of a real object that is proportionally smaller or larger than the real object. A scale describes how the dimensions, the measures in the objects compare. So a scale factor is a ratio that is used to enlarge or reduce similar figures. So here we have a wind-up mechanism. This is the actual size. And here's a larger scale. The scale factor is 1 centimeter is equal to 2 centimeters. So what, what is 1 centimeter here is 2 centimeters here. So we see like a blown up version, a larger scale of this wind-up mechanism. We can increase the actual size of a mechanical part to a larger scale to clearly see the small parts or mechanisms. And scale factors allow us to proportionally shrink or enlarge an object. And many artists, architects, engineers, and other professions use scale drawings. A map is a scale drawing. The measures on a map are in proportion to the actual distances. If one inch on a map is actually equal to 20 miles, the scale is one inch equals 20 miles. We can write a scale as a rate to solve problems. The width of the state of Ohio is shown on this map. Here's the western border and here's the eastern border and it's saying on the map this is five inches. Using the scale, what is the actual width of Ohio? It's telling us one inch is equal to 44 miles and this is five inches. So we can write the scale as a unit rate. We can write a proportion. We have 44 miles to one inch. And since it's saying in the map that this is five inches across, we need our one inch to equal five inches. So we multiply it by five, which means we need to multiply 44 miles times five. Do a little multiplication on the side, and we see it's 220. So the actual width of Ohio is 220 miles. And a cartographer is a map maker. That's the person who makes a map. We turned the scale into a unit rate and then made an equivalent rate. Here we have a very simple drawing. It's saying here's Sarah's house, here's Tala's house, here's Bob's house, and it's telling us that Sarah's house is seven and five tenths centimeters from Tala's house. And our scale is one centimeter equals 12 kilometers. So using the map and its scale, what is the actual distance between Sarah's house and Tala's house? So we think we write a proportion using the scale as a unit rate. We have 12 to 1, that's our unit rate, and we need this 1 centimeter to equal 7 and 5 tenths centimeters. So we're going to multiply it by 7.5, which means we need to multiply 12 times 7.5. We do a little math on the side. We have one decimal hop, one jump, in the problem, which means the product is going to have one, isn't it? So we get a 90. So we know this is a 90. We multiply 1 times 7.5, which equals 7.5. So we multiply 12 by the same number, 7.5, and we get 90. So Sarah's house is 90 kilometers from Tal's house. Map scales can vary depending on the size of the area being mapped and the size of the map. Here we have a map of Oklahoma, and it tells us one inch is equal to 50 miles. But when we move out away, and here's Oklahoma, this little area, it says one inch is equal to 250 miles. So map scales can vary depending on the size of the area being mapped and the size of the map. We're finished with Lesson 7.2, and we're going to move on to Lesson 7.3, which you can see is split into three different parts, and it's about converting within measurement systems. 
Have a really nice day, and I'll see you next time. Bye.